Hello everyone and welcome back to another tutorial for the Beaming Drive game. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can change your control settings. So let's get started right away. First of all, open up the Beaming Drive game on your device. And you may choose from the various different play modes to start various different challenges or just roam around freely. Now if at any point you wish to change the settings for your controllers, then simply pause the game by pressing the pause button, which is the select button on your joystick or the escape button on your keyboard. Once the game is paused, you can navigate to the options menu and then click on it. Then you can choose the control setting from the left side and you will now see various different key bindings. You can choose the various different scenarios such as the general vehicle, the camera controls, as well as vehicle specific controls. Once you have navigated to your desired option, you will see the various different buttons that have been assigned. In order to change the button that you currently have, you can simply click on the currently assigned option for your desired control. And now you will be asked to press the button that you wish to assign as your control. Once you press your button, by editing it from the edit option, you can simply click on the apply button. And now this button will be added as your new control right away. You can also add additional buttons for the same control by clicking on the plus button. Now, there are a lot of controls that you can change within this game, so navigate carefully to the one that you wish to change. If you make any mistakes, you can reset to default for both your keyboard and mouse as well as your controller by using the reset to defaults option. After making your desired changes to your control, you can go back and continue to play your game with your chosen settings right away. And there you have it. That is how easy it is to change the control settings on the Beaming Drive game. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more useful tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again in the next one.